Hello friends and welcome to Smiley Gaming. Today we're back playing Sim Casino. All right, today I think I want to build I don't know like a like a business room and uh, maybe a bingo hall in my previous episode. Uh, in one of my previous episodes, I didn't uh, I didn't do I didn't do that in my other casino. It doesn't have a business hall or a bingo hall, so we never actually set one of those up. We did set up a very small business room, but that's when I first started playing. I think that was in my first episode on Sim Casino that I set one of those up. In the last episode, we uh, used uh, the eyedropper tool, the clone tool, if you will, to clone all this and duplicate it. So instead of laying it all out again, we just duplicated and we use the same technique to build our three-story hotel here. So we build one room, clone it and constantly uh, constantly build some more rooms uh, like that and then we just paste it, paste it, paste it, paste it, paste it. It's good and then we do the same for that, for that, for that and then three floors up. So for the for the bottom floor we just grab the whole lot and then was able to paste it upstairs. Ooh. Game's freaking out. Probably can't paste it. No. But yeah, so, um, we're, we're still in debt, we're still massively in debt, which is, which is, which is not good at all. Um, I haven't had any luck finding out why, and, uh, the, the trash problem here is absolutely insane. It, uh, yeah, it's ridiculous. Uh, also, we're not able to get all the deliveries for for ATM. So I'm thinking maybe we can do some staff changing. So see how everyone's on one, one, one. I think we're just going to bump that up to five. Confirm. And then Saturday, Sunday, five. Confirm. We'll do the same for this one. Just everyone that we can change. Here we go. And this one too. Five. There we go. So now that should, um, that should give us a couple more people. But uh, hopefully we're able to get these ATMs stocked. So these uh, these security guards should go out and and restock all those ATMs instead of one dude trying to do it. Uh, now with the trash, oh my god, the trash is unbelievable in this game. Why does there money bags just loitering all over the place? Look at that. I think it's because we had no security guards. Um, do we have enough housekeepers? Can we can we get more? Can we get ten? Can we do that? Just 10 housekeepers, please just run around, clean up everything. Uh, cause it absolutely, it looks like, it looks like shit. It looks like, it looks like shit. Just being honest. We are gaining money here, which is interesting. And we are gaining money from Furrow Heights currently. I wonder if our vault collection will just give us heaps of money. Don't know. We're probably about to lose a lot of money. It looks like our vault collection is giving us a lot of money. Ah. We might, uh... We might jump back in the green. We'll see. We'll have a look. Uh, alright. So, over here, over here, over here, over here. Where would we want the business center? Um, do we want its own little section? Do we want to push it out some more? Uh, let's put a door down. Let's see what it looks like. Okay. Door to the outside. Ooh, outside. That might be a good idea. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's do that. Let's do a little outside section. I reckon this would be a good idea. And then we can, um, um, I don't know. Because I, I don't want to block those windows off. What if we just make, like, its own little, its own little building around the back? like that and that could be like the business room and i'm gonna have pathways going to Ooh, ooh, my uh my brains are buzzing let's uh delete these i drop fantastic all right we'll just put it out there for now maybe um maybe we put a a fence running along here yeah just temporarily so we don't have people running around like a bunch of crazy animals 
There we go. And then uh, we'll put the path connecting to the door over here. Fantastic. Uh, where do we want the door? We can either have the door on the side or over here. Um, let's go. Let's go over here. And then uh, we'll also use the uh, the copy tool in this one as well. It might not be actually that necessary to use the copy tool because it's just a conference table. But uh, we might be able to copy the layout. So 5x4 is this. So the room needs to be at least 6 6 by 6 maybe? 8 by 6 Something like that. Because it can't be placed near the walls. So we just place down one of these and then grab this, no, this, and we just rough guide it out. Yeah, it's a very small conference room. It will allow you to fit heaps though. And this is, uh, this area has got big business, I believe. 180%. Okay, so it's got, it's got the least amount of business. So we won't have too much business. Okay. No worries. Uh, all right. We'll just clone that then. Uh, all right. So that's the layout I kind of went with for the uh, the big guys there. I'm going to put doors in the middles here. Maybe big double doors to line up with the um, line up with the table a bit more. Uh, it's not exactly private, but um, you know that's uh, it's not really my issue, is it? Why do so many people want to use the uh, I want to use the computer room here. This is uh, it's pretty crazy. Anyway, speaking of computer room, let's set up a small conference area. So I'm thinking something like that. We can grab our wall tool. Oh, we've got parties coming in. And uh, maybe not that small. Maybe that small. I'm thinking. Yeah. And then um, we could probably do the double doors still. There we go. Ground's all done now. It doesn't look too bad. I kind of like that. Um, our money is looking so good right now. $170,000. This is excellent. What day is it? Okay, it's the next day. What? How much did we earn the last day? We earned about $578,000 from our vault collections of a million. Oh my god, people. Oh my god. This is beautiful. Look, $740,000 in vault collections today alone. 7 a.m. I reckon... I reckon we dropped so negatively first... Because we're doing, we're spending a lot of stuff at the vault. I don't know, man. Well, day two. Here, it just took away 303,000. We only got back eight, uh, 183,000. Or, or, we're just making so much money from this place that it counteracts the negative loss of Farrow Heights from our, our currently empty slot machines. <laughs> but there's no trash. The ATMs are all good. This place is uh, this place is picking up, which is excellent. Uh, let's uh, let's focus on some wallpapers here, just uh, before I get too distracted by how much uh, money we're making. We're actually making a fair fair bit. I think we're up to like a million in debt when we started the episode. I'm unsure. Can't remember. Um, let's just do red walls. Um, I do like the look of these red walls. Um, it, it is the color scheme that we have in the, uh, in the actual casino, but uh, it's just so good. It's just so good. How could you pass it up? All right, let's grab some windows. Let's just, let's just smarm them all down. I don't think smarm's a word. Look, they love the windowed ones. Fan flippin' tastic. There we go. Now we just have a sea of windows. <laughs> it's a lot of windows, man. There's like no privacy in this building whatsoever. Uh, yep, that's that's just what happens. Uh, can we uh, remove these guys? Yeah, we'll remove those guys and we'll remove those guys. Uh, excellent. And then uh, well, let's fix up these guys then. Fix up those guys, those guys. And then, um, yeah, I think I'll remove these ones as well. Oops, not that one. And then uh, remove these guys. There we go. Uh, we'll set up some tables and chairs and stuff over here. Uh, what type of uh, tables and chairs do I want? I can either go like big, uh, the big leathermen over here. 
like so. And then uh, we can put some put some couches there. We'll probably put a bar in here if we really want to. Um, how much space does a bar take up? I think it takes up way too much. What about uh, here? Blocked by fence or wall. This place loves to freak out. Look at that. Dude, that looks good. That's good. That's not good. All that's not good. <laughs> oh man, that doesn't make any sense. Let's place a bar because we're renegades and we like our businessmen to be drunk. Uh, let's grab some sofas. Let's make it red because uh, red's the theme of the day, apparently. Uh, I feel sorry for these guys in this room here, just staring at the uh, all the liquor being poured over in this bar. I'll just put some seats down. Um, we could probably put uh, put some more seats at the back here. Maybe. Uh, like so. Oh, blocked by wall. Come on. Come on. That is ridiculous, but that's fine. <laughs> that does my head in, man. That really does my head in. Um, yeah, for sure. Why not? Holy bejeebus. Oh, wow. Hey. These guys are freaking out so hard. What's going on? It's not even stocked yet. I think some of it's stocked. Wow. Wow, okay, maybe... Maybe... Maybe not. Maybe not. That is... It's like summoning people from the nether, all right? It's like... <laughs> no, I don't think I want to do that. All right, let's uh, let's get rid of the chairs. Go on, get... Oh, we'll keep those chairs. Um, but we'll just have this as a big open space back here. Maybe we put uh, statues, maybe? Um, I don't know. I'll do decorations uh, a little bit later, I think. All right, so we're actually back up in the red a fair bit. I don't know why. Maybe it just... It just sucked all the people over here to the bar. Um, which makes me realize I don't have a bar. <gasps> Unbelievable. But I just figured out what I can put up the top floor. Excellent. I was like, what do I do with the top floor? What do I do? Um, now I know. Let's go back down. Let's uh, eye drop this bad boy and make it all red. Fantastic. Um, we also need the... Oops, there we go. We also need the, uh, this one here. Yeah, so let's do that. And then cough drop this one. And then we will do that. Uh, one more, there we go. It, uh, that would, it, it would explain why so many people were coming to, coming to the bar in the, in the conference room because there's no bar in the, um, in the center. I didn't realize I didn't put a bar down. Uh, unbelievable. It's like, it should be, it, the bar should be one of the first things that you put down when you open the casino. All right. 100%. Like alcohol and gambling, uh, from the business side of things, it just mixes. Like you, you, you want people to be drunk in your casino. It's insane. Because they're, they're like logical thinking skills just deplete. So you, you want people to be drunk. Simple as that, you know. Shady practices are, are casinos big game. It's what they're, it's what they're known for. It's what they love doing. Any, any way to keep the customers uh, engaged and inside of your casino is is the practice they'll look forward to to trying out on you. Um, let's grab a bar here. Can we grab... We could probably grab a couple, a couple of bars. Do we want the bar here? You know what? I think I do. I think I do want the bar here. Uh, all right, let's grab our sofas and chairs and, and hollow blues. Let's grab whites. Uh, speaking of whites, let's change this. Go seats. Go the 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 black silver ones here. Although they're just they're just black. They're not really two toned, which is weird because I thought they were um, uh, seats and white. Yeah, here we go. People are drinking now. Fantastic. Uh, the monotone color is a bit uh, is a bit hectic, but it uh, works out. It's fun. Lots of people are coming upstairs now to go to the bar, which is which is lovely. So we are gaining some bar money. Uh, maybe we could do a little a little toilet, maybe. Um, I'm thinking maybe we put the toilet here, above this, and have like a uh, 
have like a underground, uh, not underground, but like um, like a second floor overhang. Actually, I don't know if you can do that. Yeah, because you have to have a foundation. You have to build within a foundation, right? Or on a roof. Ah, oh, that's, that's annoying. We might have to build it uh, here instead. Yes. Uh, Cause let's say I wanted to put, can I put a door going outside? Let's see, I can't even, can't even put a door outside. Um, and if I wanted to build a floor, let's just grab any floor here. I can't, I can't place it down on the, on the, on the wall here. No indoor area selected requires a foundation, see? Very frustrating. No matter. We will just build out this area. Uh, foundation. There we go. Oh, nope, sorry. Wall tool. Pushing all the buttons. Uh, let's trap some people inside here. Suck it. Uh, okay. While we're here, we will do, we will do this. There you go. And then uh, now we want this to be a toilet, which is in one of these buttons here, which I always forget. I think it's comfort. Comfort, yeah, comfort and guests. And we'll go gender neutral, just so we don't have to work with multiple different uh, bathrooms here. We can just have one big one. And then we'll just uh, slather the back wall full of toilets. Let's, uh, let's actually keep a middle section here. And then we can put some windows. Uh, if people want to jump out of the second story building, that's... Yep. People want to do that if they want to. No judge, no judge. Let's do that, do that. Let's put, uh... Can we just put, like, massive double door? <laughs> so people can see inside the toilet? Nah, let's, let's not do that. But we will, um... We will have two separate doors, so if we do that... Uh, let's grab our design tool make it white make this one white as well all right people are digging on the toilet right now which is fair enough you know when you gotta go we're back to negative again it seems like we're just hopping the wall here let's uh let's grab all the no hang on we need tiles uh brick let's grab this one there we go and then we go flooring tiles and we'll grab uh this one do we want that one no nah, it's a bit uh, it's a bit hectic i do like this one i love the the pattern inside the little uh, triangle diamonds here. And then we'll put the windows in. Uh, we could always do do that. That looks nice. Excellent. I don't think you can put them behind the bathroom. No. That's not too bad. Uh, do we have trash cans? Trash cans, yes. Let's put, uh, let's put a trash can there and a trash can on the other side. There we go. Oh my God, people can fall off the balcony. Let's, uh, let's change that. Right, I'll just go along and do all this real quick. All right, there we go. All that's done, which is fantastic. So now it doesn't look like uh, people can just fall off the edge of the edge of the uh, runway here. All right, we've got a bar happening. We've got a conference room happening. The outside is not painted whatsoever. Um, let's uh, let's change this. Uh, so let's go bricks. Do we go just like old brick? We go like white brick. Do we go this brick? I do kind of like this brick. I don't know if I want the, everything that brick. This kind of looks like some type of uh, slate, though not brick. But it's like almost wooden. It's like some oldie hotel, big stone slabs. I don't mind the stone slab look. That doesn't look too bad. Or these ones. This is a lot of money to do this. I'm, <laughs> so I'm spending a lot of money. How about um, absolutely disgusting? How about that? How about... Uh, I reckon that's a good color. <laughs> what a weird color. I mean, I guess if you're making like an old rundown building, it might look all right. Same with this brick. This brick's a bit uh, a bit neater. Um, how about we go the slat here? Yeah. Yeah, I think we'd do that. Uh, all right. Might be able to put some like outdoor tables. I don't think you can do much with water. So you can't... Um, there's a couple of fountains, but there's like there's a fountain, you know, but there's nothing, um, nothing really that stands out too much. That you can do fountain stuff. 
but um uh, it's like the only water that you can play with you can't create little pools you can't uh, make your own water, water spouts i reckon i reckon that'd be a great idea just uh from a from a decoration standpoint you know half this game is is just building up and designing your own your own facility here um so it's the game mechanics and the design level of it you know people want to be creative when they build their place um, that's why I also believe it should be you should have like a 45 degree angles on things So if like for the walls you can only do 90 degrees Which is very annoying, but uh, you can't make diagonal walls um, Diagonal walls would be excellent. You can Do heaps more with diagonal walls, but at the moment everything's everything's square and everything's on a 90 degree angle The machines the even these guys are on a 90 degree angle. You just can't tell because they're round uh, <laughs> Um, they were saying something about it being hard coded into the um, into their into their software, so it might be a bit tricky to implement a 45 degree angle system. But uh, but yeah, all right. So I think that might be for this episode. Uh, so we managed to get uh, get our money back here. For, uh, so we're back up into the green for now. Um, we've laid out uh, a good flooring for our conference room here. Um, which no one seems to be using, but then again, it is five in the morning. So that's fair enough um, We managed to uh, set up so we can pick up more trash So there's less trash on the ground by increasing our housekeepers down here and housekeepers and increasing those guys um, I also researched uh, instant delivery trucks. So if this guy fills up like so you see how he's got a lot of trash I can go down to inventory and teleport call early and then um, he should show up eventually and take my trash. There he is. He's a good lad. Go on. Fantastic. Um, yep, and then we set up the bar upstairs. So just, just again, rough. Um, but we can focus more on designing later. Next, I want to set up a, a bingo hall. Um, and I think I'm going to put it on top of this roof here. So people have a reason to come upstairs and uh, enjoy themselves up here. And we might also do some uh, some greenery around the bridge just to make it look a bit uh, flamboyant instead of looking like garbage. <laughs> That's all right. Well, anyway, till next time, thank you for joining. Hope you have a lovely day. Thank you for liking, commenting, subscribing, clicking the bell, doing all that lovely, uh, that lovely jazz stuff. And um, till next time, peace.